besides taking a shower. That's the only time I put it in my locker. Yeah. Uh, walk me through that play. How did you uh, read it? And how did you come with the interception? Um, uh, basically, I was in the post coming from the boundary, and I was showing um, in the middle of the field. So I kind of figured the quarterback he was going to throw it to the boundary because uh, with that single X over there, he's going to take the shot. And so he didn't. Uh, I guess he saw me melt over there when he uh, when the ball snapped. He threw it. He uh, overthrew the overall coming towards the middle, and I was already over there uh, to make the play. So overthrew it, and I just tipped and overthrew the kick. So that's what How satisfying is it to, to win on defense, not just with this play, but this week with scores? Um, you know, uh, making big plays like that on defense. Uh, we was harping after um, the first half. We need some turnovers for the offense. You know, uh, giving them a short field. So little stuff like that. The touchdown, not little big things like that. Touchdown, scoop and score, the interception to seal the game, you know, stuff like that really helps our offense at the end of the day, giving them a short field to go down and score and do what they need to do. So it's just like we're both helping each other out at the end of the day, um, you know, just stuff like that. Prior to your pick, it had been a tough day defending the pass. What was the issue there today for you guys? Uh, you know, it was a, the first half was a tough day. I'll, get, I'll say that. Um, but, you know, we came, we went to the locker room, um, revamp. We said uh, we came up as a defense. It was like, it's not like they're doing nothing crazy. It's just simple pass concepts. Just need to see our keys play, do what we do. You know what I'm saying? It's simple stuff. Uh, it's nothing like they was throwing some all type of stuff all over the place. It was just the same route. You know, once you see the keys, um, you got to just do what you need to do. Go make that play, you know, and stuff like that. That's what we did in the second half. I felt like uh, coming out of halftime, you know, got back together as a defense, said what we need to do, came out, did what we did. So that's what gave Saloon, you know what I'm saying? What did you see on the play when they called touchdown and then reversed it and said Uh Personally, I don't think he scored. I dead ass. Oh. <laughs> I, I for real don't think he scored. I don't even think he got his foot down. But, you know, uh, pass the difference. I mean, so I really not. When they said that, so I was kind of I was kind of happy. So, I mean. But did you see the play come out or, or, or that collision where that it was thrown for? Yeah, I did. Uh, well, after the play, I did. Okay. Uh, so, um, when they ran the little pick route, I had to work over top. And I, in my head, I thought he didn't score and get his foot down uh, in the end zone. But they said uh, it was a touchdown, which kind of made me mad. But And then they threw the flag on the offense. So, you know, gave me another opportunity to go out there. The next play, you know what I'm saying? Not worried about that play. The play's over with. The next play mentality. How does your mindset That's adjust when it's um, – when they're, they have to go back to the 16 and the 17 seconds to go? Um, you know, uh, keep things in front of us. You know, time's running down. Uh, we got to get to that quarterback because, you know, sacks, kill drives, you know, D-line uh, D going back there, doing what they need to do. And then us on the back end just playing top down, uh, go track the ball out, go make plays on the ball. So that's basically all, you know what I'm saying? So. Thanks, BJ. Thank you.